miss the seagulls for you. But we're at the red, white, and blue. Aaron's getting something out of the truck. We had to come down here to get our packing supplies, so we always stop by and see if there's anything that we can resell online for a profit, us and the rest of Tampa. You know there's over two million people in this city, and we moved to a city with just over 3,000. Anyways, what is he doing? He's taking forever. Okay, I'm pushing the cart. We had to take a potty break. So I gotta get my bag. What is this? That looks like $14.99. Wow. Really? It's cute though. See, this is a vintage Liz Claiborne. If it was a different color, it's a cute shape. All the resellers are here. I see them all. You can spot us a mile away. That one's cute. Little brown, $7.99. I didn't check the sale. I came right in and went potty. Oh, come on. That one is cute. Hmm. Well, I don't know what this still sells for, but that's a cute shape. We have an alligator. $5.99. A fluffy purse. This looks like Liz Claiborne. Yep. Vintage Lizzie. It's a leather bag. Oh, thanks. Here he is. There's a cute little beaded purse. Sack roots. A lot of you guys say that these do okay, depending on what they are. Coach here, $24.99. Under Armour bag. Betsy Johnson bag. There's another one of those. Set boots. $7.99. Oh, a little pair of Bradley. That's not sewn. That's interesting. This beaded one. Oh, that's vintage. Let's see the inside. Interesting. This gives you like Gucci vibes, but it's not. Like vintage Gucci. There's supposed to be Fendi. Fossil. That's a nice pattern. These have the little vintage wooden handles. Probably handmade. Very cute. Oh, look at this one. Look at this one. Oh my goodness. I have to see it. Oh, my bag is falling off my... That's kind of cute. This one screams Jesse to me, but it has like some color wear. Sorry, I wasn't looking through my lens. Okay. This one is all me. Oh, the strap is messed up. Had to change hands. Okay, let's get to looking. Ooh, this is nice back here. Hey, hey. $5.99. Okay. I like that. We have some $2.99. I hear the cart. Let me go look. Ooh, it got really busy all of a sudden. I'm over here because it's busy in the other areas. So we're looking at the plate. Total Crafts. 
Mm, maybe nothing there. These are really pretty. Excuse us. These are Winnie the Pooh letters. Okay. Or something. We can look up. Oh, what are you? Lamplight Farms. You're just missing your shade. Aren't they always missing a shade? Here. There we go. Hey, that fits. That's kind of cool. How much is the base? It is neat though. Well, it's some kind of price. They'll be able to tell from the bottom. I just don't know. Yeah, so I'd have to take them off separately, but if I bought them. Okay, I'm gonna go this way. Let's sneak through this guy. Excuse me. Right. You're fine. Ooh, look at that. I really played Georgian. Look at that. Oh, I love it. Anything else up here? Some ice buckets. Those sell pretty well. Any craft stuff? There's a big, oh, big paper trimmer. Well, some of these little wooden carolers are cool. This is a full Christmas section, actually. Bunnies. Look at this. All taped together. Oh, made in Japan. Not that that's bad, but it's the ones that look like global. And look, some old tape cassette holders. Ooh, he's neat. He's missing probably a Halloween pail. Mm. Any good craft bags? Oh, there's a couple of fancy markers on that one. Pencils. I haven't really found much in craft since that particular day. Some glitter. Now some of the vintage glitter is actually really finely ground glass. Got some stickers. And embellishments over here. Those are cool for junk journals and stuff. I don't need all those pencils though. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's $20. Those are those little village pieces. All these little bits and bobs. Look at the little Kokeshi doll. I might get this side. A little space needle. Um, pencil sharpener. That's cute too. Look at those little guys. What do they say? I might grab this too. Oh, that's pretty. $12.99. Aaron's found someone to talk to. Grab these. Oh, one of our people. Mm. Okay, let me keep looking. I'm gonna keep this. is cool. 
I like the colors in the little angels. I just can't read what's on there. No, not that one. A little turtle trinket box. That's cute for five dollars. Oh, sorry. Here's a Jim Shore piece, but it's got a broken wing. Oh, and one of these cute cows. Oh, she's got a broken horn. Darn, those are cute. The cow parade things are very cute. Let me see if there's anything else over here. Oh, here's a little blue crackle vase. Here's a funny little camel. <laughs> He's cute. This is cool too, I would look at that. I picked up a vase from down here, a little vase. Let me see this. That looks nice. That was 20 from wherever. Excuse me. Let's see. These are neat. They look antique. Well, I bet Natalie would like this giant cow head. Oh, these are cool too. Aaron McNutt. Little, like, almost like church windows. A giant decanter for 25. This is a really cool. It's a doorstop, it looks like. Looks like a D doorstop. Celadon type vase. Oh, my eyes are scanning, my eyes are scanning. Oh, this is my type of thing all the way. I didn't even check the um, sale colors. I didn't either. As I, the TVs are on. As I don't. What's up with that? Let's see what else is hiding in here. Oh. What is that thing? I don't know. Here. Anything. Your best bet here is to keep up with them cars when they come out. Really. Yeah. Well, that was hard in that moment because I, I had I my camera and my hands were full. And then three other ladies were like all over the cart. So, let's see. I was trying to see if I spotted any more. I know this is a Yadro company, guys, like I know, but they already want 20 for it. And that's not a more popular um, figurine. Little bunnies. Oh, almost dropped the little bunnies. Hmm, those are cute. Let's see you. Some maracas back there. A lot of big seashell. Was this Linux? Yes, we'll get this Linux. Butterfly, we've always, I've sold every one of those. Check it over yeah. Okay. Okay, let's look over here. I'm I already checked all that stuff out. You checked all the house. Let's see if we can spy any good candle deals. I don't know who this company is. It smells pretty though. It smells like flowers. You never really find the floral stuff. It's a lot of the uh, vanilla bean and amber. It's a lot of the fall stuff. That doesn't even smell like anything anymore. What is that hiding in there? That's pretty. I saw someone with a really pretty floral painting in their cart. Oh, that's a... Uh, that's cute. It's a print, but... That is so cute. I think I might grab that. And they stuck it right this... Hold on. 
I stuck this right on there. Okay, it comes off. Gonna say. Look at the little angel tray. That's so like 90s to me. Like a cake stand. We need one for ourselves. Cake stand. Yep. Yeah. That's a Ooh, bigger that's a cool rooster. Oh my gosh. I'm like dropping everything. Here, I'll hold that. <laughs> Give me your bag. Well, I don't want to leave it in the cart because my wallet's in there. Cute bunnies. Then, of course, I'm going to look over everything that I picked because, you know, oh, yeah. you got to. I'm just kind of flying by the seat of my pants at the moment. This looks like Polish pottery. Yep. It is. Oh, and look at this with like a gnome. Mixing bowl. Holiday time. Only $2.99? I'll grab you. Now my hands are full again. Where are you supposed to put these things? Mm, probably little flowers. Here, I have found this too. Little Polish pottery. Look at this. Oh, it's a shaker. Where's the other one? That'd be cool. That's neat. Planters peanuts. I know some of these sell for a bit of money. We should look up this planters peanuts jar. Some of those actually sell really well. I don't know if we'd get a signal back here, but that's too heavy for me to <laughs> lift with my oh, ripper. Right. Um, maybe planters peanuts clear square jar. No what? No signal? No. I see one with like the guy on there and everything. And it's no, it's a square jar. Silverware, all these bags of cups. So that's where you could get some good molds though if you do crafts with those. Those. Oh, those are really beat up. How much is it? We've made it to the toy section. Hey, those are those video game things. Oh my gosh, $60. 60 bucks? Yeah. I would be safe to assume blue is not a sale color. <laughs> Everything is blue. Yeah, the, it, the TVs aren't on to tell us the sale colors. There's more video game things. You put these like on a base and you can like, on this base, and you can play the character. That one's seventy dollars. Like cool uh, oh, amiibo. What else do they have? Here's some more of them. Oh wow, yeah. Star Wars ones. How much are those? Forty-four dollars. Forty-four dollars. You know, I bet you one day these things not in the not so far future are probably going to be desirable. There's another one. Because they were really expensive. I don't even know. Yeah, they were expensive are. for sure. You could be all these characters. Yep. That was the way you, to get a new character. The amiibo sold game. out immediately. You couldn't Dang, get that. Someone had a really big collection. Look at that. Another There's one. More over here. Wow. Yeah. This one's 70 bucks. That's why I said safe to say that blue is not a sale color. Yeah. Well. Not a sale color. I find out. There's a little vintage chair there. Let's go to the girly stuff. Oh, well, there's some ponies. You're not buying anything. Didn't you want that thing from the... Oh. I thought it was Hello Kitty for a second with that red polka dot. Lots of stuffed animals this time. Mm -hmm. Wow, it's almost all stuffed animals. A couple of dolls. Yep, got a little stamp set right there. I know. I know, it's not as easy as it looks. 
Now you see why I get annoyed? <laughs> yes. It is. All right, do you want to go look stuff up? Sure. Let's go. When you're filming, this stuff's not as easy as it looks. I know it's not as easy as it looks. Now I can, I, I can vouch for her. <laughs> this stuff is kind of annoying yes. and tough to do. It is. All right, do you want to go look stuff up? Sure. So that is going to be a wrap on our red, white, and blue um, thrift trip. We're going to head over to our packet supply place, and then we're going to hit up a couple other thrift stores. So. So that's going to be it for today, for this video, and my hair's in my eyeball. And um, say bye, Aaron. Bye, everyone. <laughs> bye.